Not happening tonight, but we start with warmer weather leading to an outbreak of violence in Philadelphia. Three people, the youngest just 15, killed on city streets, including a deadly stabbing near Rittenhouse Square. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lanz is live in Center City with the developing details. Shante. And Joe, a 35 year old man was stabbed to death at this busy corner. Many, including witnesses who tried to help save his life, say that this all started from an argument. The blood still is, still is on the concrete over there. So, you know, kind of upsetting. Shock and confusion from onlookers on the corner of 17th and Sansom Streets. Crime scene investigators search for clues outside of Luke's Lobster Restaurant in Rittenhouse Square after a deadly stabbing. Philadelphia police say a 35-year-old man was stabbed in his neck before crossing the street and collapsing. The male was picked up by um, fire rescue and transported to Jefferson Hospital, where it's pronounced at about 7.15. Police arrested who they believe to be the attacker. Sources say the stabbing stemmed from a fight on a sidewalk around 6.15, possibly between two homeless men. Detectives searched down an alleyway for the knife. This seems similar to one two months ago, just a few blocks away in a park near Walnut and 18th Streets in Rittenhouse Square. A 51-year-old homeless man was also stabbed to death during a fight back on Samson Street. Onlookers can't help but feel for the victim. Especially if he has kids and stuff. It's a sad thing to hear, you know, that on a warm evening like this, your family got killed. And again, one person in custody, no word yet on any charges. Reporting live in Center City, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Shante, thank you for that live report.